You want to see me make Doc porridge? You can't believe it to be true. You know I've had Doc before. This Doc pudding was in an old... It was an old Easter recipe in a book I came across before. I didn't know you could eat dogs either. But um, apparently they used to stuff them. They used to make a dog pudding. In an old sock. Probably. <laughs> well, here we have the dog food. That I have. There's chops. I just picked them out of the garden. I didn't rinse them. I just picked the bugs off. Um, I just did. I'm going to do it with... Anymore, because I've got some in this jug. It's probably the porridge that's making it. Maybe it's full of mites. I don't know. That's why me and the dog eat the same a lot of the time. Because if we both come out scratching, raw, or throwing up, then we've got a fair idea what it is. Um, they are natural histamine and uh, and histamine, antihistamine. I did think about giving a pyroton, but I don't have any. Um, and I know I've forgotten. There's, you can give them Pyroton, but not the other one. And I can't remember which one's which. I went to the other day to get some of their Pyrotees. And I was like, do you know what? I can't remember. And I thought, do you know what? Let's just do this. I know we need to find out what's making her itch. I know. But currently, everyone's issue, everyone, is that she's itching. Why is she itching? She's itchy. Um, we'll just see if we can deal with that, shall we? And why am I making it into porridge rather than rolling it into a ball? Because she's yipping at me because she's hungry. And she's looking at me. Like she wants something to eat. Um make some pasta. No, we had rice for dinner. <laughs> it's just it's the sodding porridge. I want porridge, what are you gonna have with it? Probably a bit of brown sugar. Um you can't give dog sugar. It'll make it weird. <laughs> she doesn't have a tiny bit on there. Um give her an almond. I haven't got any almonds. What about walnut? I'll make her itch. Well, no, I'm all nuts, Ollie. Your brain, yeah, brain has it. It's gone underneath. Get it or the mouse will come. Um, we come in, Ollie. Dock and walnut porridge. That's what I'm calling. Um, What am I looking for? I can't see a damn thing in here. My brain's gone. Um, fig? Dock and fig? Oh no, all fig. Use the pig instead of the sugar. Dock, fig and walnut. Um, I don't know. That's a snack, Johnny. Um, why can't I feed the damn dog properly? <laughs> Look, I didn't choose to feed the sugar. She came eating sugar already. Her old owner used to, whenever I would go to visit, would give her a bowl of cereal with sugar on it and go, she likes something sweet. So, do you know what? I tried to humour him <laughs> by following on his old traditions. She does like something sweet, anyway. Probably why she's itching because she shouldn't have citrus for it. Well, do you know what? I just should. Um, I shouldn't do a lot of things. Uh, I don't know how to do this. I haven't done it before. <laughs> this way. That spider was disgusting. It looked like a walking cyst.
I hope I did smash it in and not just flick it onto the floor. Uh, it was on the outside window ledge. I was sweeping over, guarding its nest probably. Then what should I do? I've got this old furniture polish, this wood balsam, which I think is beeswax and meths probably, and I just wiped around the window frames and did the blind to the bedroom. Um, and the bed frame again. And then I sprinkled bicarb all over the mattress. Um, gave it a good shake and underneath the bed and her bed and shook it outside and did it again which is what I did last time um, I'm not going to have a banana now no no more water really boil it oh, just in case there's any thing in taps an old mouse that's crawled up it and just gone to sleep forever could happen you know, these old houses like <laughs> right, um... like some kind of witch with your fingers in me she smells like the cat in the neighbor she sickens. I think about blue and white, no, blue fingers and mittens again. Um, because blue salt's being mess. And so a blue finger would be like, you know how you used to dip a peg or something in things to like pop them around or maybe like a, on cotton wool or something just to leave it on a shelf or, you know. finger might just be a lollipop stick to it to me, right? and it pops in your mitten to keep the to keep the moths out or something. <laughs> this is what I do, think about different things things could mean. Well I know they probably didn't mean that when they originally did it but it might be the lead into something else. I'll tell you what as well, I did hang a bit of this old string. my plum tree bush head this old do you remember I got this before when I was making things out of it um, so I just cut a bit off and then dipped just dipped the little tips the tip end in the mess and then hung it in the tree out the front oh green flies seems to have gone where have they gone I don't, I don't really care <laughs> I don't really care I don't really care they <laughs> <laughs> they've got away so they have appeared to have gone there um, kind of counts as organic gardening isn't it uh, and I did the same thing with the apple tree the other day um, because it was a, a bit weird wasn't it I just did a straw, a piece of straw in the mess and, and put it in the ground just as a test to be honest. Um, just a tiny, 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 tiny bit. Because the ground is a bit like, you know. a bit belchant um, I'm not playing with chemicals I'm just Mark Star I think <laughs> that's not playing with chemicals he said that's what it's basic chemistry um, I have a crystal grey set when you're a child
I'll be running my kidneys and packing them again later on. I should have a dandelion to this, so I should have a dandelion and, and dock. Um, that's not burdock, it's not the same, I know, but I made that mistake before. Um, I was wondering as well about this, this spider nest out the front under the window. What I was thinking today when I was looking out the window just in case anything was crawling back in was um, maybe putting, oh they're going to love this, like um, that bucket, <laughs> I'm going to make it sound really bad, that bucket of stagnant water I've got down the alley as a water feature for the dragonflies to um, to go in. Um, so they can eat the spiders as they fall out. There was a, I was watching a load of little gnats and things flying around, so they might might do some of the job. I'll tell you why I was thinking about that because when I was out in the garden earlier on, thinking about something along these lines, there was a white feather in the in the pond, and um, that's often a a signal, isn't it? Feathers appear when angels are near, and if you find them in unusual places, blah blah blah. Um, I wanted to do that before when I was trying to make uh, that concrete thing so I could have one out the front with some sort of eat. I want to say lily or something in it. Uh, I haven't really got around to doing it. <laughs> if I put a bucket of stinking water out there, you're going to call the police. <laughs> I just get a broom and hit that nest. No, I can't reach it with the broom. It's it's about thirteen feet in the air. I don't want it falling in my mouth <laughs> or knocking all the, the baby spiders hither and thither. Um, I don't know what they are. You know exactly. I don't know. Ugh. Disgusting. I know I didn't put them there. I know that. Um. 
So there, that's what we've got. Dots in the pan with a fig and some lemon juice and some walnut. That's not going to help a bitch at all. <laughs> Probably not actually. Um, wait and see. Maybe we both did potato fast. We did it last time. Oh, carrots. Oh, I don't carrot fast. I suppose. Wait and see. Dolly, what do you think? She hates it all of that. Hey, this is a different page. Put some honey in it instead of sugar. I could do actually. I've got some special honey. Um, Special honey. Ooh, honey. Oh, chocolate. <laughs> chocolate. Ooh, honey. Special. You can't get this anyway, do you? Where do I get it from? I got it from somewhere. Um. La 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 la. I got from a man. <laughs> a man gave it to me for doing something. What did I do for him? I gave birth to him. Um. Made ginger beer, I think. I can't remember what that was. <laughs> I can't remember what it was, but I know when um, I know I put it there for a special occasion. Um, there. Maybe the cat walked through the garden and left a flea. I did put a flea treatment on it the other day, but do you know what? Well, I did. Um, that's what I need to take to the vets. I bought it from the vet. Um,
I don't think this looks like pink. There we go. <laughs> there we go. So, I'm really tired actually. Um, lucky with me. I'll see you later. And I'll probably be just as moody tomorrow.